So apparently right now there is a big Petsy 99 drama going on and uh, yeah they are literally competing with GameFam to become the worst gaming companies, dude. Like, seriously, why? Why are they doing this? Alright, so early on, there's a tweet by Sizzle's Jelly Queen, which was deleted as of right now. And I'm gonna show you why later. And so that's why I'm using a Crewcraft's video right here. So apparently, Big Games was like rewarding the exploiters that was in the game. Like, they found a bug and they reported to Big Games. So like big games could just fix the issue and it wouldn't persist any longer and possibly preventing the economy of Pet Sim 99 to like die or anything, you know? And what did they get for the reward? They get like really good pets if I'm correct. Like extremely huge Titanic, like if I'm correct it was like a rainbow huge pet Titanic. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not like a Pet C99 master, but I do play Pet C99, so yeah. It's like a really really good pet, which is insane. Like you could have gave any other pets out there and you chose to give the rainbow titanic huge or something. You know, and the hackers could just sell the pets for more, you know, things in the game, which is insane. Like, I can't even get a huge or a titanic in my account at all. <laughs> oh man. And sure, you could say it's like one of those white hackers thing where, you know, a developer would like pay hackers to like find bugs and glitches in the game and then report them and they would pay them and stuff. But why would they pay them with like a rainbow extremely rare pet? Like not even with money, why? You know, that just begs the question. And we have this tweet over here. So much negativity in the Pet Sim 99 community. I think majority of it stem from the clan situation. Yeah, totally bro, totally. Time to introduce some positivity. And we got this reply over here. Delete the rainbow shiny, ti yeah, shiny titanics. I thought it was a huge or something. Which you gave to exploiters who abused a glitch and got 20k hugest for free that they still have that will improve the game. And then he replied, boring topic and next. Like, Bro, true man. Big games will handle the situation greatly. Also, big games, my tweets are my own. Yeah, totally, bro. You're like working in a company, you know? Whatever you say kind of represents big games, right? <laughs> Am I wrong here? And the reason why the tweet was like deleted, I think, it's this. So, the YouTuber Sizzle's Jelly Queen, you know, the person who made the tweet about that, has been removed as a big games partner. Like, how petty could you be, man? Accept some criticism. Let me guess, she critiqued big games? True, yeah. Dude, they just can't take it. They just can't take the L. <laughs> what can I say? And her account is currently like this right now. She's not banned from Twitter. But you know, big games doing something shady in the background. Not that. But she temporarily like disabled the account. Which is great, alright? It's not like big games actually did something. Well, I think big games just made her delete the tweet. I think that's it. It didn't do too much collateral damage to her. That's great. So yeah, overall, um, Patsy99 definitely messed up. They could have like put out like a response, like a good response. But you know, Josh, the uh, <laughs> person that's working in the company, just say something that just kind of represents big games, right? A am I wrong here? So yeah, comment down below what you think and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next one. Bye-bye!